Hello inventors, this is Saro. In this video, we will learn how we can create counting app using MIT App Inventor. Using this app, you can count anything. Okay, suppose you have around 1000 cups, you have around 1000 or 10,000 some things okay then you have to count them so there's two way you can count it manually or you can count with your app okay so how this app will work let me show you so here you can see we have three cups okay uh, i have like one two and three okay so how we can count them using our own app so here you can see the count is zero now okay now i'm putting my uh, phone here like this simply okay so you can see zero so let me just move it okay one two three three right so that's the overall app we will create how we can count curves and anything using our own app so here we go so we are using your mit app inventor to create this app so open this website ai2.appinventor.mit.edu then click on start new project and my project name is counting app click on ok that's my first screen ok and now drag and drop your two labels one and then two and change this label one text to zero and make this font size 70 and make this text color to white and then click on the screen one and change this background color to black like this you can design according to your requirement click on level 2 and make it at least 40 or 30 something and change this text color to white this one also and change this text to count okay and click on this screen and make it align horizontal to center align vertical to center okay now in the left side you will find the sensors option sensors and drag and drop your proximity sensor okay and now go to the block section click on this proximity sensor so whenever proximity sensor dot change then we have to change the value of our label so click on this variable let's create one flag first so just uh, this variable name is flag and now I'm going to make this value is true okay like this now this is the uh, flag name okay you can make it anything okay now the value is flag value is now true okay now whenever let's click on this control and you can see if else condition if click on this logic and check here if the flag value okay if the get flag value is equal to true okay this one if the value is global true it means the condition is right because right now is flag value is true then click on this level one and you find set level one dot text this one set level one dot text value should be click on max and you'll find plus and the value should be increased by two okay this should be true i will explain you how why we are not using your one why we are using your two and then click on this level one and you can see level one dot text it means that now whenever one cup or one thing will pass from our phone then this will count as a two okay now the value is suppose zero then this will count as a two and zero will make two but actually the thing is why this thing is happening because this code will call on proximity change okay this code will call two times and if now we will set this value cat flag set value i'm to make it false and if the value now the value if the value is false okay if the value is false then we will minus this value you'll we'll find this one and then copy paste this here change it from here and the label one minus value from minus one only one okay so this will minus and this will set as a value now now we have to set whenever the value is minus then we will set this flag global flag value is true 
as you wish okay so let me know if you have some doubt you can ask me on command and please subscribe my channel like this video and share this video have a nice day be safe bye bye